Hello guys, this is GHV TV. Today I'm going to give you top 10 richest Kumawood actors and actresses and their net worth. But before I continue, don't forget to subscribe to our channel GHV TV. Don't forget to also comment and then like this video. Unconventionally, the Ghanaian movie industry has been divided into two. Those who act in English so-called Gollywood and those who act using the local dialect, predominantly Chi, who are mostly referred to as the Kumawood. The Kumawood, or using the local dialect to act, have been there even before the Ghana theatre came into existence. However, the Kumawood came to prominence when Kofiadu aka Ejako shifted from acting on stage, that's concert party, to enter into movie acting about more than a decade ago. They have never turned back and according to GHP.com's research, the producers release between 10 to 40 movies per month. As a result, has made some of the actors featuring in more than 50 movies and still counting making a lot of actors and actresses amazing worth for themselves as well. The acting is lucrative to the extent that the likes of Akroboto had to come down from Belgium to act. Emilia Brobe was once a teacher but now an actress. One particular thing a lot of most people or fans across the country will always ask or will always wish to hear is the salaries of how much an actor or actress is paid per movie. Now before I give you the list, the methodology GHP TV used to compile the list takes into consideration four main criteria. 1. How much they charge to act per role in a movie. 2. Endorsement deals. 3 other businesses and four we assume their net worth now starting is clara benson aka mame sewa mame sewa's net worth is $75,000. Don't underrate this child actress. She is one of the highest paid Kumawood actresses. Credible information reaching GH page has it that Clara Amwatin Benson earns at most $1,500 per movie. This is about 7,500 Ghana cities, making her one of the richest celebrity kids in Ghana. This had made her acquire some wealth and properties for herself. Next is Bela Samoa. Bela Samoa's net worth is $85,000. As funny as it may sound, some people prefer to call him the Kumasi John Dumelo, perhaps the fine boy breaking the ladies' hearts. Rose he keeps acting in movies merited him the name. Bale has starred in over 200 movies and has been in the industry for over 22 years now. He started with movies such as Sika, Choice and Co. Bale is one of the most sought after male Kumawood actors of course had made him well to do. He is a married man with three children, two boys and a girl. <music> Next is Mercia Siedu. Mercia Siedu's net worth is 90,000 Ghana cities. Tagged as the woman with the most chest bosomi in the movie industry. Though Mercia Siedu has been acting on stage. She rose to fame when she starred in the movie titled Asoriba and she never looked back since then. Her impeccable role in the Asoriba movie made her the toast of the fans which made her featured in over 200 movies. She quit the seamstress or fashion designer dream to become a full-time actress which is her main source of income. According to her, she has made a lot of money from movies to the extent that she's been able to sponsor or cater for the first son's education in the United States. <music> Next is Kwaku Manu. Kwaku Manu's net worth is over $130,000. Kwaku Manu is one of the comic actors in the Kumawood industry, a one-time highest paid after Lewen and Ejeku. He is a product of Tetemrafra production owned by ace actor Alexander Kofiadu. Kwaku Manu came to the limelight in the year 2010. 
He has featured in several movies including Village Champion, All Die Be Die, Kokubo and Sam, Asori Penin, Oyas Roya, etc. The actor Kum musician has managed to draw lots of attention to himself using his extremely hilarious acts and funny comments in the movies and baits. He also has a YouTube account which fetches him money. Vivian J. Lawrence is next. Vivian J. Lawrence's net worth is over $150,000. Kumaud star actress and the mother of two, Vivian J. on several occasions has disclosed that she is one of the richest actresses in Ghana. Monitored by JP TV, the actress first made that revelation on a Nijefie TV, on a Nijefie TV show on RTV, when they visited the actress in her house at Santase in Kumase. In that interview, properties of the actress were shown for about 50 minutes. The actress on that same show revealed how she started her acting career, her business aside acting and the source of her worth. The second time GHP spotted the actress speaking about her worth and how rich she is was in an interview with Delay when the Delay show train arrived in the Garden City years back. Akwasi Bwedi, aka Akrobeto, net worth is around $180,000. Akwasi Bwedi, popularly known as Akrobeto, is one of the versatile actors in the Kumawood screens. Akrobeto, born on 18th November 1962, happens to be one of the favorite actors in Ghana. He is a native of Ayerebi, a suburb of Akim Oda in the eastern region. The actor who began his acting career way back the 90s has been starring in countless movies in Ghana. Akroberto rise to fame was as a result of foundation given him by the Crystal Safo Drama Group, which used to perform regularly at the National Theatre of Ghana on the platform of Concert Party. He is definitely one of the top actors in the indigenous movie screens. Akroberto on several occasions has said that the Kumawood industry pays off despite how most people are certain their movies. The actor on the delay show stated that he has been able to acquire houses with his acting in Kumawood and has no regrets abandoning his search for greener pastures in Europe. Akroberto has purchased cars and built two houses, one in the Ashanti region and the other in the Greater Accra region all of which are made up of eight bedrooms. It is rumored that he has also involved in Galamse mining business, where he also acquired a lot. <music> Kofiadu, aka Ejako, is next. Ejako's net worth is over $200,000. Kofiadu, born 25 May 1969, aka Ejako, is a multiple award-winning actor and comedian from Ghana. He has appeared in over 200 Ghanaian movies such as Obatampa, Black Stars, Matrikewo, etc. As a shoemaker, he got discovered on a Ghanaian comedy show, Concert Party, on GTV, which was staged at the National Theatre in Accra, where he worked as a comedian warming up the crowd. He was once the highest paid actor in Ghana until Lewin dethroned him. Ajako currently owns a music band and film production dubbed Tete Mofra. He also who doubles as a musician cannot be left out in the list of popular and richest Kumawood actors of all times. JPS can state. <music> Nana Ama McBrown. Nanama McBrown's net worth is over $250,000. Nanama McBrown is the richest Kumawood actress today. GHP.com can state she doesn't hide her worth and how much God has blessed her. Born Felicity Amajman, Nana Ama is the highest paid Kumawood actress and have starred in over 200 movies. She is one of the most biggest Kumawood actress with the most endorsement deals. She is the most successful actress, appealing to both sides of the Ghanaian movie industry, Kumawood and what they call Gollywood. Nana Ama has been scoring high points with brands as well. Her endorsement cuts across beauty products, food and home appliances. They include Go TV, Colorado, Hisense, Soft Drinks, 
etc nanama now drives one of the most expensive and latest bands in town as we speak kwajon kansan le win net worth is over three hundred thousand dollars Kojong Kansan, popularly known as Le Wen, is one of the most versatile and very popular Kumawood actors in Ghana and undoubtedly the richest jtrade.com can state. The 28-year-old comic actor is the highest paid Kumawood actor and have featured in several movies like The Azonto Ghost, Buja Kron Kron, Sika Kasa, Bon Sambofo, Obenti, etc. He has received multiple awards in the Ghana movie industry and the Kumawood and Akoben movie awards as well. The win started from the scratch with nothing to his name but has struggled against all odds to amass worth worthy of being talked about. Besides the acting roles, he is also a musician and has several endorsement deals to his name including the telecommunication giant MTN, Hisense and many more. He also owns a school at Offenso and also that is fetching him a lot of money.